Taiwan has approved the emergency use and production of local manufacturer Medigen's COVID-19 vaccine. The Food and Drug Administration says that the shot has no safety concerns and that it produces antibodies 3.4 times greater than two doses of AstraZeneca. Health Minister Tun Suzong says that Medigen should be able to deliver a small supply to roll out nationally by August. FDA has a expert NVC COVID. Medigen's vaccine has been approved for emergency use and mass production. After a full day of discussion and review, and after considering all our relevant requirements, it is our conclusion that Medigen's vaccine is free of safety concerns. In addition, it is in line with relevant indicators. We have two very important indicators. First, the geometric mean titer ratio among recipients of Medigen and AstraZeneca was 3.4, with a 95% confidence interval. That ratio ratio is far greater than the required 0.67. Second, the zero response rate of Medigen vaccine recipients was 95.9%, with a 95% confidence interval. That greatly exceeds the required 50%. FDA Director General Wu Xiumei said the application was reviewed by a 21-person panel of experts. Approval was granted in a vote of 18 to 1, with one abstention and one favoring a second review with more documentation. She said that approval was for use on people aged 20 and older. We have approved some conditions on its use. One is that it is appropriate for adults 20 and older. The main reason for this is that clinical trials were conducted on people 20 and older. Regarding administration, this vaccine comprises two doses to be delivered 28 days apart. In addition, as recommended by the experts panel, during the designated manufacturing period, the drug manufacturer must provide a safety monitoring report every month. In addition, within one year, the drug manufacturer must submit a report on the vaccine's protective effectiveness to domestic and international agencies. The report must include adverse reactions following the vaccine, etc., as well as efficacy findings. All of that must be reported to us. In a statement, Medigen emphasized that it will perform safety monitoring and conduct phase three trials in accordance with all regulations. Medigen thanked the participants of its clinical trial and its research team. It did not say when it planned to launch mass production. Currently, the production capacity is still relatively small, as its reaction tanks are still relatively small. A new manufacturing process is being implemented. It has only just received EUA, and it will take some time before it can expand production capacity. After the vaccine obtains approval from the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices, it will be included in our vaccination campaign as soon as possible. By August, we expect to have a small supply ready to deliver. Meanwhile, United Biomedical has its own COVID vaccine candidate under FDA review. With two domestic vaccines in the pipeline, Taiwan is making strides to securing the supply it needs to protect the population.